Hello everyone, this is Faruk Aydin Toxos. Today I want to talk about a recent feature of guitar plugins called Doubler. As most of you already know, Neural DSP is providing this feature in all of their plugins since the release of Archetype Petrucci. I was very curious about if they are good enough to use on recordings or in live performances, so I made a comparison in between mono track, stereo tracks and by using the Doubler. I even tried it on my live performances with my band Alkera and now I feel like I'm ready to share my opinions with you. First of all, let me explain what the doubler is and why guitar players need double track guitar recording technique. For some musical styles, such as rock and metal, rhythm guitars sound so wide and despite the amount of their volume, it never crashes to any other instruments in the mix. To achieve that, double track guitar recording technique is used. All the guitar parts are played two times, identically the same into two different separated tracks. And those two tracks are hard pans to left and right. That creates a guitar wall in the borders of the mix. It provides a free space for all the other instruments inside that walls. It's a pretty easy technique for guitar players to perform in recordings. But when you step on a stage, it is impossible to use double track guitar recording technique with only one guitarist. This is where the problem begins. Because your guitar sound on stage, doesn't be as wide as it was in your recordings ever. Doublers are imitating the double track guitar recording technique. They are basically separating your mono guitar track into two hard band stereo tracks and applying some slightly random delays and detune on one of those separated tracks to mimic the double track guitar recording technique. Let's listen how it sounds like. The quality of the doubler blew my mind away. I was not expecting something that good. This doesn't mean it can be used on recordings yet, but it is a perfect upgrade if you are a single guitarist in a band like me. Feel free to share your opinions in comments and if you like this video, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more contents like this.